Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tutorials, and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you the SETI UI theme. Now, we showed the material theme. Now, I'm gonna be showing you SETI, which is another popular theme. So let's check it out right now. Now, throughout these videos so far, I've been using the material theme. Now the material theme is a great theme that many people like to use. However, another really popular UI kit and theme is the SETI UI. So if we head to Atom Preferences and let's come to Install, let's look for SETI. S-E-T-I. Now you'll notice since I had my checkbox set to packages, all we have is SETI icons. If we select this, you can see that it's some icons for the SETI UI theme. What we actually want to do is in install, instead of with packages checked, we want to check themes like you saw in the installing a theme video. So if we look for SETI, you'll see that there's a SETI hyphen UI that's used 255,000 times. If we can install this, you will have access to the SETI UI theme. Now this is just the UI theme with the file icons. What happens if you want to use some different things? Well, we have a beta release. If you want to check out the beta release, which, you know, with beta releases, you might have some bugs. Like it says, this is a work in progress. If we head back to install, you can see that we have a Monokai SETI. So it's a Monokai style theme for SETI. We can also install that SETI UI red. We have SETI UI syntax, which is actually syntax highlighting uh, for SETI itself. So as you can see, there's a bunch of SETI UI stuff, but now that we have just sort of the basic ones and some extra ones, let's go ahead and set SETI as our new theme. You can head to themes, and you can see under UI theme, we have SETI. Now upon selecting this, you'll see a much different looking application. And let's go ahead and select a new syntax theme. Let's choose SETI as well. Now, when we go to any of our files, we're going to have a completely different looking Atom editor. You'll notice the top bar is different. These tabs are totally different. Pretty much everything is changed here. Now, let's check out what this SETI red looks like. Now, this theme is quite a bit different. We have a little bit of contrast issues going on. But overall, our menus and things like that look pretty nice. The tab bar is red, our selections are red, so things are just a little bit different. So it's nothing totally crazy, it's just a variation of the SETI UI theme that's very popular. Now we also have this Monokai SETI for our text theme. So as you can see, this is the standard sort of Monokai, but set to match the rest of SETI UI. Now you'll notice that when we did set this Monokai SETI, we had some maybe weird stuff going on. This contrast isn't quite right. So I believe this Monokai SETI is better working with your standard dark SETI instead of the SETI red that we had a second ago. So as you can see, this is looking just fine here. And it's a really nice looking color scheme. I always really liked Monokai. You can see it's even in our mini map over here correctly. So this is the SETI UI for Atom. Now it doesn't have all of the theme settings that the material theme had for it. You'll notice there's no settings cog right here to modify things. However, it's a nice looking theme and if it's one that you're used to with Sublime Text, you'll be happy to know it exists within Atom's ecosystem as well. Now I've changed this back to material because it's the theme I prefer to use and is the one that we're going to be using through the rest of these videos. So as always, this is Scott with Level Up Tutorials. If you have any questions or comments, leave a comment on this video or hit me up at Twitter or Facebook at Level Up Tutorials. If you want early access to these videos, you can subscribe to Level Up Pro for $8.99 a month, $95 a year, or you can purchase them at early access at store.leveluptutorials.com. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.